All right, in today's video, I'm gonna share something very, very important for all the Samsung Galaxy phone users out there. And if you love watching Samsung contents, you should be a part of this community. Go ahead, subscribe to the channel and hit that like button if you find this video informative. Now let's dive right into the video. Now we all know about the Good Guardians application on which there are multiple modules available. There is one important module which you need to install on your Galaxy phone that is called the App Booster. This is a tool within the Good Guardians application that manages runs profile guided compilation on your installed applications optimizing their code for faster launch times and smoother performance it claims up to 15% improvement by pre-compiling frequently used parts of applications especially useful after major updates now in some of the regions good guardians is already available but in most of the regions it's not available so what I have done is I have left a link for good guardians application the APK in the description you can install it on your galaxy phone by by tapping on that app just make sure you disable the uh, auto blocker on your settings and install the application and within good guardians application as you can see we have got multiple modules available and each modules you need to separately install on your phone through the apks and you can see i have already installed galaxy app booster here i will leave an apk link for this as well so first install good guardians and then install galaxy app booster now let's go ahead and tap on this you can see it's a very simple application but it can do wonders now let me show you something here it says we suggest you to run galaxy app booster right after os upgrade and after that once per week to maximize performance now i don't know why samsung is not making these modules available in all the countries on all the galaxy phones i think they should make this available but anyways this is what it is now this is the interface we've got uh, an option here on the top that is optimized now I've got 630 applications, which not only includes the uh, third party applications or the system applications, there are some applications which you will not even find it in Galaxy stores, you may not find it in Play Store, but they are embedded within the settings menu within the system itself, even those will get optimized. Now here I can directly tap on optimize to optimize all the applications. And we have got an option to select only optimize applications used in the past 30 days. And this is going to take some time. It says run time approximately 15 minutes or depends on device performance. So if your device is not performing so well, if you've got any issues on your phone, then it is going to take a little more extra time for this, uh, this optimization to happen. Now here it clearly says improves performance up to 15%. Some applications may be restarted and your device may heat up during optimization. So you don't have to worry if the phone is heating up, you can go ahead and optimize your device right away. Now let me show you how this works. I will select maybe only optimized applications used in the past 30 days. I'll select this and there are 391 applications. Let me go ahead and tap on optimize now. You can see SIM toolkit, Google Play services, all these emergency SOS, uh, tethering, you can see the shell, calendar, user dictionary, uh, module test, setting suggestions, uh, phone remaster service. So there are a lot of uh, system settings within the settings menu and within the system, they are also getting optimized here, which is something great. Personal data intelligence, expert raw application, we got proxy handler here, Galaxy avatar, device services, uh, the third party apps here, Bixby vision framework, Knox matrix, uh, and a few other setting options here. They are all getting optimized on this application, which is just amazing to see here. It also says if your device is overheating, optimization may be stopped. And as of now, I don't think it's, yeah, I can I can uh, feel some heat over here on the top. Maybe if you run for long with all the applications, it is gonna heat up a lot. There are so many options it's showing, it is optimizing. Uh, we have not even seen those options on the settings menu or anywhere. They're all system embedded settings or options. That's it, it says done. Let me tap on done here and we are good to go. Now your phone's performance should be a little better. It clearly depends on how your phone was performing earlier. If you are facing any battery performance issues or device performance issues, you need to do this on your device probably once in a month or you know once in a few weeks or once after the uh, software upgrade or update you can go ahead and optimize all the applications on a galaxy app booster application the links for both the application the good guardians and the galaxy app booster are available in the description recently we also got 
the latest version of the Galaxy App Booster. Let me just quickly show you the latest version here. It's 8.5.09 and this is supported on One UI 8.5. That is why the version is 8.5 here. So if you are on the One UI 8.5 beta, you will be able to get this latest version. If the APK that I shared is not working, you can go ahead and install the previous version from apkmirror.com. If you love this wallpaper on the home screen, we have recently added this on the uh, Volvo's application. You can go ahead and check it out. The link for the application is in the description. That's about it. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button if you find this video informative. It's just going to take a second for you guys, but it motivates me a lot to keep posting some useful contents for you. So go ahead, subscribe, hit the like button. Thanks for watching. Guys, take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.